Hey YouTube fam, good morning, blessed Sunday to you and the fam. Um, that's the morning. Good morning, family. So, I am very late. It's breakfast time. Camera girl, I wait for breakfast to go to class. But she had the class online and front room, so she can't leave. Go and eat in the meantime, turn off her camera and eat. So, I have my liver here clean and cut. And the liver here tough. But, you no, know, no, me and it will work out. Come in and pound it this morning. I'm not in the mood. I may have my do here with my make. So, I wanted boiled bananas, but she and Jerry say fried dumplings. So, I hope you're having a beautiful morning. Hope you're having a beautiful day. I'm going to take you through din through breakfast and through dinner in one video. So, as soon as me go through breakfast, you know, and as we move into dinner, I'm going to move in. Cause look here. And I'm not next to for breakfast for dinner, you know. So I'm just gonna be my put in my, my dumpling. I'm gonna see my fried dumpling till the week. Not true. So I think I wanna make my dumpling them flat today. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna go do the dumpling them in another pot here. And then after I do the liver, I always do it like that. To see if I look here. That's a one now my kitchen, you know. <laughs> Mm -hmm. That's what is going on today, Sunday, in my kitchen. So, I'm going to go and start fry my dumpling them. And then, as I go along, I have some tea already, but I feel like it's hot though. Hot. Well, I sent me a wash with rain and turn hot like a fire. You feel like, say, the, the summer things start. Because for the past two days, I've been really hot. So, look, kitchen hot. So, look here. May I finish up? It's the Friday and dumpling, yeah? Put in them dumplings here the first set actually. Then we go come season up the liver with them. And now as in as we go along, we go a little chilling, chatting, women in the kitchen, cooking and talking. So me catching at the next video. I don't bring it have no shape, but who cares? Yeah, so family. Me day and me and dad day talk. We have to go find ways. Well, we never wasted food, but actually sometimes our children does. Even though they are adults and if you have your children, then live around you can't talk. Then not understand, they tell you no waste nothing. See? Our, our thing no. So you know what happened? We can't waste anything. Cook less. We have to start cook less. And if you don't cook less and it not eat and it not finish, we have to start store more. So you don't know when me I check about wow the fan I got blow black pepper. Me I check so if you get some extra storage container here right now. I was looking online, that's why them so expensive. If you start store up things here yeah? so this is gonna you see this i got teach we know say for the people and we love waste food and you know we have some things that we waste throw away we have got enough and i, will, I want it and can't get it anyhow this thing here continues so i'm gonna be thinking of making some different ways and we want to think about that where we can store food maybe we with as we as housewives mm -hmm, or we can store food yeah water mm. is a very important thing to that yeah, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. people who rely on you know we get water and stuff and what i'm this here i know you have seen lots of videos and you see this pot right here, so you know, all the people must see a wonder. What are we in a pot here? It's, I want boiled water in there, and I have bigger ones. I'm gonna do a video, teach you how to boil your water, because that I'm gonna be in a shell supply. Do you know things like that? Yeah, everything. everything. If things <laughs> not really calm mm. down, you know? Mm. So, this is water I have in there from time to time to drink. Okay, so boil it but you have to know where you have the boiling water is something you have to be very very i turn me turn on my pattern and put cover my dumpling you know family so all oh, them that flower they look like look in the pan it's a bad breed mm. so i'm seasoning my um my my liver lots of garlic me use all the garlic in a mint liver and so let me can use a little piece of ginger so. Yeah, so I'll finish seasoning up this. I'll check for my dumpling then. Well, dumpling the pan then. Yeah! We have to go learn to start get the water from the top, boil it, sterilize it. Or if you have somebody will have them cool or something there, 
sterilize it and don't make it second and straight. We're gonna get into all of that because things are getting complicated, so to speak. Right, Dad? Yes, exactly. Mm -hmm. So, may I go continue with my other family and in the next week. I'm running late. When I'm running late, I always get mixed up. Next week. Yes, so, this is coin iron family. So, you see? It, the dumpling, them have a prettier color. So, I them little over here popping. I pretty just put in a um, little bad breed dumpling then. And on this subject of dumpling and bad breed, Casey has given me nine extra grandkids yesterday. She have nine puppies this at time, fam. But she's a sweet girl, so. I'm gonna send prayers up for me for find food. We feed nine more picnics until they're ready. As they yeah, open. One puppy. And they're all black again. Every single one, not even one of them. Tumpa jeans strong. So, I make my local dumpling. Them. And you know, some are hungry too. But I feel like I put it on that smaller burner here over there. So, because I think it's a bit too. Yeah. Yeah, I put it on that one. Yeah. Yeah. I call them just soak out now. Yes. Yeah, so. I finish um, season up my liver. So yeah, we have to learn now to stop wasting food, sit down and have some little meat and talk with your family. Stop wasting food. Not mommy alone for learn to put up. Anybody, daddy, anybody come and see extra food, put it up, freeze them, wash. I'll, I'll be doing a few videos to show how we can, you know, learn for just make sure so we have little, little things. A lot of people have big refrigerator, deep freezer and something. Put them up, things where you never find little ways, come up with it. That you can have things you know i'll show you i think i can show you how to do your yam and maybe your the sheen i'm gonna me and dad are gonna work on the green banana or we can get the green banana peel but we can use to get it freeze and it not come work or i'm gonna do it coming up with a few of those videos but we have to work on certain things and when we prove it and proper it we're gonna come and share it with you this is a serious time not time for joking all right so I'm not putting a start, I'm turn off my fan this, okay? I'm going to use my fan. Okay, look here, the kitchen is rough. So I'm going put, to put that down. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You know what? Check it first. I'm going to go and rub up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. You can see, say it's tough in the family, so it's the dark color we have. But I'm going to pray over it, because now I'm going to have to go beat it. But look here. Mm -mm. I'm going to eat another one there. I have the time for that and the water now run right and something some rubbing this yeah I'm gonna cut up some of that pepper dad the pepper you're not rude you know I'm not seeding it in there now I'm gonna the taste piece you see even with me dinner work list man you never you know bad man you know, you know that. <laughs> that's what I yeah man so Harry family I'll catch you in the next clip Alright, my dumpling done fry. I'll see some cold deliver. But look here. Finish. I'm gonna put them back in the same container because look here. But we need the flour in there. We not consider that dirty because my water is so bad. So my flour is never dead. Me make it come halfway cook and then me see if me did put enough salt. Me don't bet me put salt, but we see as it go along. We can't wait for finish. Can I go up on the outside? Go eat for me a little bit. So I catch you back and remember I'm saying to you start learning to store not just dry food learning to over process things like you get some yam i'm gonna show you that video i know maybe a whole lot of people might know already still so i tell us away and that the cocoa the dashing i know how to do that those are okay mm -hmm. I do a video on that. If you'd like me to have to do that, I'm saying I'm gonna do it though. I don't know if nobody wants it. If you would like to, you can drop it in the comments, you know. It is gonna be a serious time it's, it's, if it if this thing continues or escalates, especially for parents with 
huge family, a lot of kids, you know, picky kids, they don't eat this, they don't do that. You have got to find a way it's going to be really hard on you. If you are somebody that you can afford a deep freeze, a chest freezer, and you don't, you're not the owner of one as yet, and if you find that you can, you can afford one, try investing in one, it's going to really be coming. It's going to come in handy, you know, as you want to store stuff. Hmm? Learn to buy bulgur. Go check out my cooking channel. Learn to make bulgur dumpling. Bulgur is something that is very good. Teach your family. Teach your children. Make it. Go, oh man. Do it. Because we are going to need them if this thing escalates. Eh? So we got to be. My, my old people them always say better to be safe than. Better be sure. Where you go? Better to be safe than never. Better to be sure. Something like that than never. Take precaution. Next clip. I work on that tough even, you know. You don't know, it's not going to work out today. How many of you cook something that you can't say, wait, it's not going to work out. Well, look, so I mean it's not going to work out. So I have to come on, I eat your mama. Mm -hmm. I used to say, nothing I eat, yeah. So I don't have no worry for it. I used to say, it can be water, my friend. So, I'm going to put in a little ketchup. I'm going to put ketchup or tomato paste in my liver. I mean, like it, it helps with the gravy. So, about mm. three tablespoons of ketchup, make it in here. Mm -hmm. And you see the sweet pepper and the onion, because I never want them there. Eh, eh, I'm going to vinegar. I'm get my vinegar from. Yeah, you can only put kind of fat tips on the back of the liver here, you know. You too, you can. Brown it up in my own, you see? I make it brown up to come out. My tree body, I use all the things in my pan, you know. Pan the top to the fire. Now, you know, I just have it brown down. And I have it covered. I make this idea here. And I just put the salt in my own, the salt in the wood. Yeah, let me see it, sister. You want another minute or half minute, yeah. Look at the side and now they're still on it. Yeah, man, it's the case of the liver. Yeah. Fix it up in it then now. Mm. You know, from the other day, I can't get none of my nice little size sauce. I'll put the size sauce here kind of salt, but you can't take a little extra kind of extra salt. So. It's a size size, it's not my speed, but it will work. Eat up eye. Wow! You hear me, Chloe, powerful. So let that bill in there, look, you see? You see that? Yeah, so watch me, I know. It's okay, Chloe, I take it so. It's so bad this morning. But, boy, that. Right off, turn me a turn that off. Oh, you yeah, look bad. Yep. Turn me a turn it off. You two family, you wanna see me next? A breakfast. So this is my dad family. So, see there? That it look like me. Should I get some color though? But honestly, me never ask the kids if Jerry forget. Cause them can't choose the color for me. So me just leave it. So look here. Me go get something. What do I try then dump it up on the outside and make it to know that car inside you're really hot. So next clip. So parry me try for go outside for go eat or don't know but too much nice on the outside. So maybe right here so my drink of Colasco. Yeah. I'm back my dumpling. You know where I come to back in the fire. So, I'm going to try if you tell me what you Guess what happened? We have got to learn, especially if those with big family, we have small kids we don't understand. Start from now that in case things get worse, 
you will not have no problem for feed them because when that happen and you can't get this and you can't get that and you have your children them for feed and because them they used to eat certain things and something start teaching them not only them some of the adults them to them love waste food you know when them say food they cook and leave back and sometimes you as parent or mother or wife or whatever you go gone in your bed you retire carry for the night because you're tired Look for food left back on the stove, teach them to put it up before it gets spoiled. Because mm? guess what? They're going to need it. Now I'm going to be business as usual. Fill with a second and throw in the garbage. We're going to need it. Mm -hmm. Teach them to go roll flour, make dumpling. And two, when you get your flour, if you're stocking up on flour, store your flour in the deep freeze. Make sure you store it that it not get wet. But you're going to use a hair tight container or the bag that you have it in. It, it can stay in the flour for over in the, in the flour. Flour can't stay in the flour, can stay in the deep freezer over here. Leave your tips them below and share. Let me get to learn some to other people who are watch. Oh, you, oh, you stack up. Oh, how, 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 do, how do you plan to stack up? A lot of us have never been through anything. I think never been through nothing like this. I don't think so. Our age, yeah, people are here that been through it, so them know. But tell me how you plan to stack up, and if you, you know, and some people always stack up for. A few months so because they have a big family and do prepping and them something that we have to start to do some of them video there. Share with me in the comment section. So look here. When you see me back again, I'm going to start work on dinner. Thanks for the love and thanks for the support. You know, we have to get through it together. So hmm? breakfast is over. I'm going to be moving on to dinner. Not anything, not anything hard though. We just going to do a little bit of sweet and sour pork and may I go um I think I'm going to like start a shove it in the oven season it up put a little panko bread cup. i'll show you i'll show you not anything big and just a little teeny bit of white rice and maybe two festivals for the kids and dinner is not anything big but i am um, on a break after breakfast what i'm doing here now i have just me just throw some water in i'm a little um cooler so when i do <laughs> you see when you when you boil water a lot of people don't understand you know you have to make your i'll give i'll show you a video okay this is boiled water in there we did strained i never shown on the bottle before i'm gonna put it on back on the tank so this is what we use to strain our water but remember boiled water is a process it's hard it's a lot you have to boil that water and you have to let it settle for about 24 hours and then you strain but when you strain these are the impurities that you have leave back you have got to let it settle and do not throw it to the bottom so what i'm doing right here now this is a 12 quart i think about three of these full those um plastic bottle you know the plastic bottle we put on a little tank them over you yeah you know like a cooler them so this is 16 so look here now look on the water trying to pull this about halfway a quarter and then we just put it on the stove and continue for the car we can lift up this whole thing maybe dad will lift it up when he's in a mood yeah so we have to watch it now we get it to full partly put it over there and we can pull it up and then leave it to boil and when i leave it to boil now i would not strain this off until tomorrow another 24 hours but as soon as that happens I am gonna be washing this out properly, you know, with bleach and stuff. And then I'm gonna fill it with water again, and then I'm gonna leave it to boil also, maybe later on tonight or early tomorrow morning. So at all times, we will have water. Because sometimes the brand of water, when you buy, when we drink good, you know, I'm not too fancy bottle water originally, but some brands are not bad at all. But sometimes when you go, you can't get the brand and then. You have to take other brands and it not taste good. You have to just you know, throw it out, you know, you waste your money. So I catch at the pipe most times. Boiling. Boiling is a rigorous. It takes a lot out of you. And you have got to know how to do it and make sure so the water not contaminate it. Because if you don't boil it the proper way, it doesn't make sense. You know? So if you would like me to share with you a video and how i boil my water i said before leave it in the description let me see tell me how you boil yours because it's it is a little exercise that a lot of people share with them some people might not know how to do it the people that knows how to do it them can't tell you but guess what it is for your body so it can't be too much for your body and then what i wanted to tell me too these pots are in a meal 
these pots are in a minute. I really don't do it in the loom, aluminum. I have never tried it in stainless steel because I, mean, I really have a big stainless steel pot huge like this. So I have never tried it in the stainless steel. But comment and tell me. Tell me. I always do it because it doesn't, it don't discolor the um the aluminum, you know. When you see it get that little thing there as soon as you wash it out, it comes right back, it doesn't mark it. So I always use the aluminum. From a small like Mr. Mother Boy water, you know. So yeah, me go try full up this. When you see me back next week, me supposed to well I'm aware. Season up and I start dinner. So and the eat is you your family. I'm back on dinner, but actually, me went to, I went to get a little sleep. The time is hot, really, really hot. But I had to go get a little light on for it. You know, that, that wasn't a pussy now. Me lay down for long. So actually, I'm on dinner. I have a pork season up. I'm a coat it up with a little flour. Sweet and so I'm say. So look here, this is my pot of all nice, yeah, boil water. So I boil water. I am. During the time I boil it, this, this one was 16 quarts, so it's gonna stay until about tomorrow. Maybe this time we'll strain it off. All right, so may I get my pork in now? It's actually it's time, and then me season up my chicken to make it back. Me turn it down, you know. So may I get this like a pork here in? It is this part is enough. So this about a kilo, you know. The part enough for all everything. So. Wow, let me just burn myself. Thank you, Mara. Seriously? Oh, sometimes you feel like, say, some unwanted spirit in your place. Not you. Let yeah, me turn up the thing. So, I'm going to get one of them um, wooden spoons. Something here. I just burned myself on the camera. So, let me get one start fry up fam until it start get crispy. Sure. Not written on a batch now, you know? Okay, fam, so dinner is still in progress. Dinner is not gonna be a lot though. So you see, we get my pot them on fire and never get up back with flame. And then the sweet and dandy way in a fam. So I'm gonna drain off the eyelash from my pot. Mm -hmm. So I have just made my sweet and sour sauce. That careful copy of burning a one in so I'm just just gonna pour on that sweet and sour sauce. Yeah, I'm gonna make a want a little bit of butter. Wow, sauce nice daddy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I don't have to do anything else after my putting cackle empty pops. Wow, break and chocolate water. Right, so I'm gonna put on a little extra water. Yeah. And I'm gonna turn it down. Yeah. That's how my sweet and sour pot. I'm gonna have no pineapple or anything. But it looks good though. I'm gonna make it slow it down for another 15 minutes. Yeah. In this, it's gonna be the bomb. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure some of it sounds good, gingery and everything. Yeah. So the margin ain't gonna be a lot. Alright, here. Me, uh, I was going to put the family rice on at the back here I finish up. Yeah, just that. I'm not doing a lot. I was going to put the, um, some, what that thing there? Parmesan, some cheese and breadcrumbs coating, but. Alright, so I'm going to fry up the chicken without no flour. Gluten free. I'm going to fry it down slow. And then, so I have the other two peas. Yeah, you don't have to fry it with flour in a pan. So I'm just fry it open slow. Yeah. No, no flour, so that's basically dinner. A little bit of white rice. Them um, chicken here. That was what I already planned, but I was to do something to what it here. It's not gonna happen, so. I'm gonna take the time and as we go along. Yeah, I'm gonna cook down slow. Yeah. And I'm gonna cook nothing for years. And remember to support my merch tour. I'm drinking it's actually it's really it's a really good quality family thick may I cool down myself may I hydrate myself so my water bottle remember to go support my merch store water bottles and stuff and you're definitely gonna need one of this right now because spring I come and the eat so we turn up so I'll catch you in the next clip all right YouTube fam we are finished 
dinner is true we got really cool sweet and sour pork right here yeah we can't wait for the game because it's been a while since me not eat this yeah you know so i said sweet and sour for look with the gravy thick and nice and the butcher sent some pork really cool fatty though but me and him work out that and me use it this is a fried chicken crispy and nice no gluten no flour on it rice over here so and i'm gonna plate you up some in the next clip okay now youtube fam dinner is served sweet and sour chicken a little white rice fried chicken and some cucumbers honestly eat with your eyes but that's dad's dinner that i gotta eat with his eyes and you that is gonna eat with his mouth and you're gonna eat with your eyes i'll have to move the cucumber though come and just remember said that don't eat cucumber i wanted to do a little stir fry cabbage and something but honestly i'm tired i'm sweating i hope you did enjoy thanks for the love thanks for the support and we haven't eaten since we had breakfast this morning and we're not hungry because the time is out of water remember to go support the merch yeah and get your water bottle get something else too i think this is only 20 or i'm not sure i'm not sure but go check it out i was really surprised it's good quality i didn't know it was this good so go check out your girl merch for your girl some love patreon link will be down below in the description of this and all my other videos and on all my other channels thanks for supporting remember and we had water we boil water remember to tell me if you boil water if you want me to do a tutorial and how to boil water this properly and make sure you get it come successful it is a thing that takes a lot of technique for you to get it right with temperature and make sure it's not polluted after you boil it and all of them something there and so on so thanks for staying with us today i'll catch you again on another video and for now it's gonna be ciao